In the name of Almighty Allah, the most beneficent, the most merciful. This is the seventh tutorial in Bootstrap tutorial series, and in this tutorial, we will be talking about column wrapping. Or wrapping. As I as, as I said earlier, if you place more than 12 columns within a single row, then each group of extra columns will ask you one unit or wrap onto a new line. Let's get started. How it happens? For example, we have a div class of container, and next we have a div class class of row and now uh, if you have a div class of call dash md dash 6 this div should take nine columns here we have column one and copy this control c control v and this uh, div should take uh, three columns nine plus three equals twelve and let's assign my style which I have already defined here in main.css and also my style so now let's refresh this as you can see that we have column 1 and we have column 2 but what happens if I increase this and write 4 here so 9 plus 4 equals to 13 so it is one column more than 12 column grid system so in bootstrap we have 12 uh, columns in our in grid system but here we have one extra column so what happens so as it says if more than 12 columns are placed within a single row each group of extra column will as one unit wrap onto a new line so now this is now wrapped onto a new line now this place is empty because we have uh, four columns we have one column extra than the 12 column grid system now so uh, now we have here uh, four columns so you must be careful about this now if I place three so now again we have a 12 column grid system but what happens if I say four it wraps onto a new line so now in the new line we have already occupied four uh, columns now if I use six columns here six plus four is equal to 10 8 plus 4 is equal to 12 now if I refresh so now you can see here we have again so if a column is wrapped onto a new line so the remaining columns will be counted from uh, the, the column that is wrapped onto the new line so here we have already occupied four columns so we are left with eight columns so now we can have eight column layout here so here we are again taking up the entire width so you must be careful about arranging this uh, devs in this grid system so that's it for this tutorial and see you in the next tutorial